two percent last night for our local elections anyway. But one issue that drove people to the polls was the union terminal tax. Sixty one percent of the people voted to ensure the iconic building will be repaired. So now that they have the money in place, when do they start? WLWT News Fuzz Brian Hamrick is leading the way for us tonight with where the union terminal goes from here. Well, the last time anything this big happened at Union Terminal, there were still a lot of these cars on the road. Now that they've done the hard part of winning the campaign, comes the other hard part. In the building known for preserving history, now they're making it. We're going to declare this a victory for Union Terminal. And for it was just a great celebration last evening, and it's wonderful. Supporters voted to raise the sales tax, generating about $170 million to fix the iconic building. Leaking waters created major problems, crumbling concrete ceilings gone, even structural damage. Now that the vote is behind them, there's plenty of hard work to come. Well, there is, but you know, it's a labor of love. I mean, we love this building and we love what we do inside this building. And knowing now that the resources are in place to actually fulfill that vision, that dream, uh, that these are exciting days ahead. Douglas McDonald is CEO of Museum Center. He says the money begins to be collected in April, but they won't wait long to begin. We are going to move fast, we're going to move efficiently, and we're going to move through to get this as quickly as we will borrow the money. Necessary to cash flow the project until the tax receipts come in. And the election day victory for Union Terminal is playing well at Music Hall, where they're still composing their own fundraising plans. Obviously, the voters have strongly supported this project, and uh, and I think we have strong support for Music Hall as well. So I think it gives us a little boost. Construction on Union Terminal will start by 2016, a day in the future when history begins. And even though they still have to collect the money, get the plans together, and do the construction, they still expect all of this to be done by 2018. Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5. Now, administrators say all of the repairs on Union Terminal will be done at the same time. Major portions of the museum are expected to be closed during the construction process. For more details 